Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be updating your iPad to the latest OS. So, let's just go right into your settings. Under your settings, you will see your name right on the top or your device's name. Right there, it's your iCloud. Just make sure to do that backup before we go on with anything. If you guys have no more space on your iCloud to make any backups, don't worry about it. Just hook it up to your computer and make your backup right there. If you guys have Mac, go into Finder. If you guys have PC, Windows, then just download iTunes, which is a free program, and you guys can make your backup or even update it through iTunes if you guys are having any problems. Anyways, right now, we're gonna go right into General, which is down here below. Then we're gonna select the second option, Software Update. Under Software Update, we should see this. Now, some people might see Download and Install. Others will go here and it's gonna automatically start the downloading process. Now, for most of you, it might even say Install right now because you already downloaded this. Now, the download is actually pretty small. You're looking at less than 100 megabytes, which for most of you can take seconds. For some of you, yes, with really, really slow internet, this could take 10, 20 minutes, <laughs> but that means really, really slow internet. Now, what's gonna happen is later, we're gonna see the install, and then it's gonna just restart. We're gonna see an app logo loading bar, and that would be about it. Just make sure you guys have enough battery life. So that means more than 50%. Even if you guys have 80%, even then, I recommend hooking up some electricity. So hook it up to your computer or your charger. The very last thing that you guys want to happen is for your iPad to die once it's installing this, okay? If it runs out of battery when it's downloading, it's no big deal. Nothing's gonna happen. But when it's actually installing, the update, then bad things can happen. So you don't want that to happen, okay guys? You do not want your iPad to die because you might have to restore it. And that's why I suggested making that backup anyways before you do this update. So once it downloads, we should see this, install now. If you guys left it alone, most likely it's installing by now. Let's just tap on install now. It's gonna ask you for a passcode if you guys have one. Once you do that, it's gonna do this, and then we're gonna go right to the next step. Like I mentioned, you will see this app logo, a loading bar, we're gonna see this twice. So the very first time, it's gonna load very slowly, then the second time with this loading bar, it's gonna be pretty fast, and that would be it. After this, we're just gonna see the iPad screen. It's gonna ask you your passcode if you guys have one. Like I mentioned, you will see this, enter your passcode if you have one, and that would be it for this update. Anyways, if you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.